Why, Patrick, I hear you ask, where are you going at this time of night doing your very best MKBHD impression? Well, humble viewers, you degenerate mad lads have gone ahead and watched my stupid videos and made my stupid channel profitable. Number one, thank you. Number two, how dare you? Now I am put in the incredibly fortunate position of having to either A, pay taxes and fund my local school system, yuck, or make tax-deductible business expenses in order to spend that money on myself instead. New York City, they put beans in that chili. Damn, dude, it's crazy in there. Look at us, we riding in the carpool lane, buddy. And we are finally home, but I can't touch it yet because I have to go to bed and then I have to go to work and... Uh, that is that is well packaged let's get it get it yeah the idea is to get the printer here and then uh figure out a computer situation i don't really know how big the printer is so we will see if it fits oh here's the side flap so you gotta pick it up by these side flaps here yep all right that just pops right out here it is. Well, that fits pretty perfect. Not the most secure table in the world, though. Eh, good enough for now. All right, I should definitely read the manual before I do anything else. Oh, and here's the manual right here. I've heard for the first time setting one of these up takes about half an hour, so we will see how fast we can get through this. Well, there's a look inside. What is this? That's funny, it's a Christmas song because I got it on the end of the year sale. No, Bamboo, you're supposed to be the bad, uncaring communist. Stop it. Don't you dare make me love you. That's not too bad. Oh, hey, yeah, no, super easy. Thing was not working out on the desk, but for now we have moved the Bamboo Lab over to this little nightstand where the ender used to be and the ender is gonna go. I will say a lot of the hype in the marketing talks about how these printers are just instant running gun. I can't snap. You get the idea. They're instant. They're ready to go right out of the box and you can immediately start printing. I think a lot of those comments are coming from people that are used to tinkering with printers. I think the mechanically inclined shouldn't have too much of a problem. But if you're just buying these with no experience, I think you're in for a little bit more than you bargained for. So that's an immediate takeaway I'm having. Certainly not what the hype machine would have you believe. I don't know, it just take a little bit to set up. I thought I'd be printing by now. We are going now. It's doing the full uh, self-test here. You all right there, buddy? That's pretty wild. Oh, that's not supposed to do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Oh boy. I messed that up pretty good, I think. That's not supposed to do that. Uh, crap. Oh my god. No. No, I just got you. Crap. Oh, here it goes. Dang. Why is the first layer so flat? I'm not used to that. to this. Now that I got that thing going, we do need to say goodbye to the Ender. We're doing one last print for the road and then it's going to a farm upstate. All right, we're saying goodbye to the Ender. Callie, no, no. No, Callie, it's going. <laughs> Get on out of here, I don't love you no more. <laughs> but can it print shoes? Are the shoes fit? Yep. Can I film your feet for the internet? And my strawberries. Bowie, Bowie, you're not helping. Oh, Galloway, Galloway, Galloway. <laughs> hey, Galloway, no, not you too, Galloway, come on. But to answer the question that I'm sure you're all asking, why would I go with a Bamboo Lab printer when historically I'm a Prusa fanboy? Well, 
Prusa just hasn't been keeping up with the technology. Bamboo Lab has just smashed the competition with their features and their ease of use. This thing is built like a literal tank, and if you've seen my past videos, you know that I, I mess things up, and this thing is like designed to not be touched. So not only will I think it last longer in the presence of me being the way I am, I think it can just do more, and I think for this channel being a business of sorts, I owe it to you guys to be able to do the most amount of things. So that's why I went with bamboo. It's really just pure economics, but I don't know. What do you think? Have I sold my soul to the devil or do you think it's a good move? Either way, we're about to print some pretty awesome stuff on this thing starting next week. So make sure you're subscribed and I will see you then.